Hello, hello, Impala LFX13. In a very quick video uh, for those who have um, a uh, 1920 RAV4 with the 2.5 and probably the same for the Camry uh, 2.5 and the other models. Um, just a quick video on how to uh, change and upgrade grade your uh, factory air filter. Uh, obviously, there's little two clips here and you pull it away and you're able to stick the, out the filter from the back here okay, i already remove it i have it on the table here and all i'm doing is um basically upgrading the factory denso made in the us uh, toyota filter for an aem dry flow see it looks a lot like a knn probably made it the same factory but there's a part that's dry and a part that's oil and uh, part number c28-2443 comes in this box is a little sticker in it and uh, here quickly you could see the models it fits uh, actually a fiat that's weird and um, a, a bunch of lexus mitsubishi and obviously a bunch of Toyota, so it fits a lot. And those two bottom ones, Triton, I have no clue what it's that. It looks like a pickup. And uh, it's a quick upgrade. What I'll do one day eventually, because this vehicle right now, as it sits, has only 67 kilometers, like maybe 40 miles. So I'm I hope to get a few thousand uh, miles before I do MPG tests. And I'll do with the factory filter and with this the same way I did with my fusion and another channel uh, a lot of people like to see those that's MPG before and after and also a dyno I'll do a dyno after at least while well, the first on record oil change at the Toyota uh, because I already did the oil change uh, uh, when it came off the lot, I did it all change, so that's done already. But I'll do a, another one at the uh, Toyota, so the warranty, and I'll do a dyno after that. So, quick video how to change your filter and how to improve your airflow on a multiple uh, Toyota four cylinder engines and V6. Take care, bye.